This is my wake up face. <laughs> Fully made because I didn't eat it until late. And I didn't take my makeup off. <laughs> so what? I don't care. Mm, I'm going to wash my face anyways. <laughs> um, But this morning I woke up light. Most mornings I wake up light, right? You know, I'm very intentional about um, just being love and light, right? Being positive. Um, now the mind does try to get the best of me. And I'm sure you too. You get it too, right? We have to combat those thoughts. But today I woke up. This thing was on my was on my heart for the past couple of days. But this morning I actually did it. Um, I woke up with forgiveness on my heart. I woke up with love in my heart. I woke up with light in my heart. I woke up light, right? Refreshed. I've only had like mm, five hours of sleep, but I'm re I'm replenished. Um, but this morning, um, I wrote a letter. I wrote a letter to my mom. <laughs> And my mom is deceased. She has been deceased for four years. And I wrote a letter to her. I wrote a letter to her letting her know that I love her. I wrote a letter to her telling her that I appreciate her. She was such this amazing woman. She was so, so amazing. <laughs> She was so amazing, um, but unfortunately, I didn't see it while she was here. Coming from a family of trauma, right? We all are so traumatized. We all are so, so traumatized, um, but coming from a family of <laughs> some deep-rooted trauma, in the heart of slave country, South Carolina, raised up through racism, um, battled with poverty. It was hard. It was hard for my family. It was hard for me. And I'm so grateful for it all. When I tell you I'm so grateful, I woke up with gratitude. I woke up with love and light, right? I do. I always have love and light and I'm intentional, right? But I'm forced. I make myself do those things because coming from a, a traumatic childhood, right? A traumatizing family, a deeply rooted traumatizing family, right? You know, you have to combat all of those negative thoughts that was programmed into you or the, all of those negative things that you saw with your eyes or, you know, the negative things that you heard in your ear gates. And so today, Today I woke up renewed, refreshed, and refilled. And I wrote a letter to my mom. She was so great and so amazing. Oh my gosh. This woman was the epitome of strength. Despite all the things that she went through, she was the epitome of strength. She protected her children. We may not have understood it while we were going through it, but honey, that lady loved us. She protected us. She appreciated us. She nurtured us. And so, waking up with a full, fully, almost fully beat face. <laughs> I have gratitude in my heart and in my soul. For anyone who has battled with family depression, family generational patterns and of negativity, especially as a black family, right? As a black family, we were we were we were oppressed. We are still being oppressed, but we are coming. We have come out of it. We have we are fighting it more than we have ever fought it before, and so. I just want to say, be patient with yourself 
and love on your people because your people loved you and your people love you. I'll see you later. Make sure that you like this video. Make sure that you subscribe to my page. Share it with a friend. I'm being extremely full, transparent this morning with a full B face. Ew. <laughs> Today is going to be a great and amazing day. And I claim it. I rejoice it. And I speak it over your life as well. I'll see you soon.